we've been modifying genes, not by gene editing, but by selective breeding from the beginning. How else can you turn a wolf into a chihuahua, into a lap poodle? That's what we've been doing. We just know how to do it better today than ever before, faster than ever before. What I find interesting about CRISPR and its applications is how widespread it can become. It doesn't require large labs or large sums of money. So in a sense it democratizes gene editing. And I have no idea where that will go. Uh, are, are we wise enough to tame ourselves in the presence of this awesome power that previously was only in the hands of nature? Only in the hands of nature over millennia and in some cases millions of years and now you can do it o over a weekend with a kit modifying organisms biology is still being transformed by CRISPR technologies I don't know where it's gonna land but I know there's a huge upside for the good that it could bring us all and let's just hope our culture our scientists our institutions are wise enough to get us there. Hey NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.